Hey anybody, how's it going? Welcome back to the Beyond Camera, where tonight we're watching the very first episode of Secret Invasion. It has been a while since our last Marvel Disney Plus TV show, and this one's going to be fun, because finally, Nick Fury gets to have a starring role. Samuel L. Jackson is, well, he's Samuel L. Jackson, and it's almost been a crime that Nick Fury has only been supporting character so in every other superhero's movie. Well, now, that doesn't matter. Now he's the main character. I'm going to be frank. There's one thing I am hoping for in this TV show. He's fighting aliens who can shapeshift. So he needs someone who he can trust and someone who the aliens can't really shapeshift into properly. And who is that that should be floating around just perfectly? Coulson. Coulson is a robot. He's a hyper-advanced alien LMD, and he would be perfect to show up in this show. I know. I know it's unlikely. And the same way I know that those Daisy jo Johnson rumors are also unlikely, but still, this would rock into one of my favorite shows of all time. If she, Coulson shows up, even if that is the case, we have several weeks, over a month and a half to go until the chance of seeing him. So I'm not, I'm not going to keep wasting time with this intro. If you enjoy this reaction, consider hitting that like button. If you want to see more of my reactions to the rest of this show, consider hitting that subscribe button. And if you don't want to do either, and let's just get into the video. Quick Marvel logo, straight into it. Moscow. Present day. Is it really present day though? Because isn't the MCU ahead of us yes. by this point? Oh, hi, later. Ross. Mm -hmm. Didn't expect to start with you. But I guess you're going to be our exposition character? All we can turn to are the people we care about. But what if we well, can't turn to those? <laughs> or who we thought they were. The ones I we wonder lives. if this show will reveal any big we're characters and scrolls. Agent Prescott. You know, it this feels like it would be crazy conspiracy theory. What exactly are you talking about? But it's completely true. Chaos. Thirty years ago when the scrolls found Earth. Thirty years ago. And Nick Fury okay, wait, you can date plan. this now. But now now they don't want just any planet. They want ours. All of them or some of them? You see it? You get a tiny handful known to live on Earth. That's, That's the point. To known survive. to live on Earth. You have no goddamn idea what you're talking they're about. They're disguised. That means they're our allies. Not there all of them. They will be nothing compared to this. What is this? This is the one. Show me. Show me the screen. Show me. Up. Oh. Wait, is Martin Freeman not? He's not that. That's not Ross. Oh no, it's begun. The tension. Who's a scroll and who is it? He isn't turning green though. Oh, you, you just killed a guy for being paranoid. Hi, Maria. Cool. Actually, less cool because it's like over there. It's cooler if it was if your heads-up display was in front of you. Oof. Ouch. Love this shot. You just see them going up the stairs through the window. I'm seeing Ross get some star time. Instead of just being, you know, the white guy, Black Panther. Ouch! What the hell are you doing if here? If you're him, that's not Ross. Which is why you so easily killed the conspiracy theorist. Got it. I really like that Captain Marvel made it so that some scrolls are good, some scrolls are bad. Because I was. The, I don't like the idea in comics that somehow entire spe ooh, cool intro. Species can be evil. 
Come on, there has to be like some that are good. Wait, is this the history? The planet, they're leaving the planet, there's the ship. And they're trying to come here, invasion. Uh oh, something's gonna get blown up. I wonder if this is spoiling the, the show events. Like a lot of spy things seem to do sometimes. Wow. That was a hell of a unique title card. Title sequence. That's pro that's one of the most unique title sequences in a lot of shows I've seen. Of course they use this scene when they're introducing Secret Invasion. The first scene of Nick Fury showing up. Beaming down like an alien, and then you have the lights, and then nah, it's just Fury. It's such a long time since these two met. It's kind of funny thinking about so looking at them you. now. Loved? But Did she die? But it would take something like this to bring you back to her. What happens it's since far from home? Angry that our people still don't have a home. Now, many of them are upset. What an interesting way to the change the events of the Captain Marvel, Marvel movie. Oh, well, I'll find you a home. They find, they I run off. Mate, he took your abandonment that much. Oh, so it was Fury's fault. These aren't a rogue group from Travis before. This is a rogue group from now. The scroll council. States. That was Prescott's theory. And he's gonna use this if the scrolls are immune to radiation, then that cause a nuclear dis nuclear war, the they get to live. Prescott was killed. We have a Thirty years, and you guys couldn't find theory. any it's kind of freaking planet to go to live on. You sure you guys weren't too picky? Hi, Rody. And unfortunately, we also Wait, did you call him Agent Fury? From Agent Hill to Agent Fury. Uh, he's been apparently been demoted. Been demoted. But we know they're old friends. Looks like Rhodey's moved into politics. I wonder if there's going to be some revelation where Fury didn't find them a home because he wanted to use them. That's what they're going to end up being. Oh, there he is. This has gotten captured. Girls are the Russians. Or did he want this to happen? So it's bottom shelf piss for you or nothing at all. Destroy. Destroying the city? How he What did he destroy? What are you doing in Moscow? Is that why you came down from your space station? You feel responsible? Not yet. He's trying to avoid feeling responsible. But I sure as hell know when a human is lying. You know damn well mm -hmm. which is why entirely a fire of far from home happened because Talos does not have to know about this new rather old Nick Fury I think Thanos' snap changed you oh really taught you that no matter mm -hmm. like a contact lens that he slipped on there 312 kilometers southwest of Moscow very gentle hi didn't expect to see you so soon are you telling me you're Take your part of Gravik's side? But then you'll find him to be too extreme and come back to your father? Too bad Welcome you look all green and ugly. Otherwise, like Asgard, you could just demand to have your own city. I swear, with the tech that people have, what? You can't just be on Mars. What's your name? Nice to see. What they're fighting for. A good way to show us, like, right, this is just the bare minimum of what they want. We're over 500 strong now. Though, of course, many of them will still wear human skins because you know that budget. The warriors keep our human form. The longer we attach to our shells, the less likely we can be identified by humans and scrolls alike. That's the excuse. You say that all the fighters are the ones just stay human all the time. That's a memory machine. Ah, uh, no, this is getting creepy. What is your name? They've Boy. shrunk the memory machines down friend? so much. Skrullos. Skrullos? Sk really? In my own skin. Oh, this is like a next level version of the thing. You can download more than what this, the, what the, she said, five years? You can download more than just five years using this machine. I'm considered good looking. My kind of 
<laughs> I know a bunch of good-looking scrolls. Oh, I love Ben. Okay, all right, guys. What is the play here? I uh, say we visit this rusty bomb builder. Sonya Wait, will already have agents. I hope we'll see the we real Ross in this show. Stop. I hope you it's not just a look. Where is the real Ross? We're no longer in just a war. With the operation we just showed, where the frick is Ross? Who to, for someone to take his place. We're the circle. No one else. Is that to protect me of course? We're the circle. No one else. He says in a public area where Gia can is 100% listening. You. Seriously. You. you had no sympathy. You were driven out of your homes by invading people, so you got no sympathy for doing the same to another species. That look tells me he doesn't trust you, Gia. I've been saying, I think every time I've read this name so, so long, so far, I've been saying Gia. Don't forget to hydrate, folks. Oh, tell us. Either Talos is feeding information or Hill. Because Nick Fury 100% played off how old and crummy he is. The man's playing into it because he knows he's being 136. He's playing into it. The Avengers. Midlife crisis. I'm pretty a superhero team. <laughs> Why not? Yeah, this is gonna go bad. Everything is priceless till it gets blown to bits in a hail of bullets. Everybody gets one. Nobody gets two. <laughs> so, but not right now. <laughs> ah, where are the bombs? Uh oh. And you're not the bomb. Uh, human. I got this. You? <laughs> I got this. <laughs> uh, I love that the Fury is more light hearted. But he's not having to be like the adult. Oh, that's gonna be a thing, isn't it? Not turning green. Just assume for a bunch of reasons they won't immediately turn me I said no. You're gonna have to fight the guilt your own way, Talos. They're not gonna absolve you of it. Attack. Punch. Bet. Uh, that wrong twice. Stop. You wanna hear fast? Uh oh. Daddy daughter time. It's what you always say, but there's always another. Oh. Uh, grumpy daughter. Got. She's dead. Oh shit, she doesn't know. Well, that was about as well as expected. Hey, by the way, I'm pretty sure this show, this first episode, has already put rest to that stupid theory where. Nick has been a scroll the entire time. Always good to give drinks to drunk people. I'll talk to you. No, you can't say that. <laughs> this guy's old. Can you also imagine that the fact that Captain Marvel is similarly this old? Is that sincere or just you just better? over your paces? You gonna tell me why you abandoned her? Uh, Build an outside. What well, look, no she he's not gonna tell you why he abandoned Earth. This episode one out of six. Maybe that has changed too though. Revelation ain't gonna come until three or five. Okay, let's just say I had a crisis of faith. The details of the revelation won't come back until three or five. On me. I would I don't know whether Fury is truly gonna have a crisis of conscience or once he gets back into the game, he's going to absolutely demolish everyone. I would love that at the end of that. That you think, oh shit, everything's bad, and then he's this, 10 steps period. ahead. Or like there's this. No there. Right? You're not ready for this, but that's, after the he, that's what he wants you, you to think. Told me there is no I assume it's been easy for these, these rebellious scrolls to take power during the blip period. Yeah, sure, maybe they've lost, they lost people too, but 
Earth was in such disarray. Maybe we postpone the strike. Not gonna happen. To the contrary. Ooh. Not what I expected. While you were working for her killer. How did Soren die, though? Details. I'll mark each back with infrared spray. It's gonna not work. They know. They'll know. Hey, look, we're gonna see this blowing up again. The spy movie. Last time was Mission Boswell. Judging by the intro, the title sequence, you will fail. At least one bomb on it. Maybe all of them. Infrared, got it. Thanks. Everyone's got them star glass, I know. We missed the Bags are gone. Uh oh. You were a scroll, weren't you, little girl? There's a bomb in the ball. Fury, the last bomb is in that ball. Fury. Fury, you idiot. It's in the balloons. Knew they didn't trust you. Fuck. Well, I expected that. Wait, huh? Oh! Oh, such I'm an idiot! The fake one had his eye patch on! Oh, she's fine. I'm not gonna kill Maria Hill. No! No! No, 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 bullshit. Mm. No! Not something so unceremonious. She has to be a scroll, right? And they're gonna end it because of course they are. That's all guest star. R Ross better not be dead. M Maria Hill, like, uh, I hope not. Please, there are no end credit scenes. That was episode one, Resurrection. Not sure why it's called that because no one's really. <laughs> Because people only die. This was a great first episode, right? This is not superhero territory. This is spy territory. Yes, you got shape shifting aliens, sure, whatever. But besides that, this is a spy thriller through and through. Now, this movie, this a plot like this would easily make its own movie. But this is only part one of like a six part series, so it's a bit slower than an, than an action movie. Nick Fury is slow. He's old. He isn't who he used to be. And that's kind of the whole point of this show is that after. The, so like Talos was telling some of the truth after all. Right? After the blip, Nick Fury was just rock. He used to be this rock and he was utterly shake it. He couldn't handle it. Now, he'll slowly have to like accept what's happened and he'll gain back and by the end of this, right, maybe by the halfway point of the end of this, he will be the Nick Fury who we know and love. Right? And we know that's gonna happen because um the Marvel trailer spoiled that. But before that, he, this series is going to take us there. We find out that Captain Marvel, which ended on such an high note of I'll find you a place to live with that spaceship flying away well apparently it just came back because apparently in the vast cosmos they couldn't find one planet beyond the reach of the Zandarian Empire was it the Zandarian Empire? No Zandar, Zandar was something else the uh, Kree Empire Maria Hill dying was a real shock I just I thought for a second maybe Fury was being smart, and Hill was the, the imposter, but no. Freaking Gravik had the, the eye patch and instead of the thing. I'm not, you, it's one of those details you would only notice later, not immediately. If that's the end of Maria Hill, it'll be disappointing, but a show like this can possibly change it. In the superhero world, it has an impact. 
what could it be done? Ross. Everett Ross has been playing two, has been a cool character in the past two Black Panther movies. Yes, he was a scroll in the beginning of this, but I refuse to believe like he's already been killed. I, I really hope he's not just one and done out. Yes, it said special guest starring uh, in the credits, but that doesn't mean he can't show up again later in the show. That just means he won't be be in every episode. And it entails his daughter having broken off and apparently his wife dying sometime after that Spider-Man movie. That's great. The question is, how did she die? And Gia didn't know about it. Which means she's clearly... It seems to be up there, but she's not. Right right there. It they, This guy came to here and it's just those two. They don't trust her enough. Which is either why they lied to her about this bag plan or they knew she would snitch to her dad or just don't trust her because of her, connection, because of her father. We'll have to wait and see. Unlike a superhero movie where it's like, alien attack, and everyone gets over it. This was a terrorist attack. Of course, it is still an alien attack, but nobody knows that. That's the problem. It's a terrorist attack, which is going to cause a shite ton of problems because... You know what? Despite all the aliens and stuff that Earth has faced, it still intends on fighting itself. A war between Russia and the U.S. Not a good thing. Especially MCU Russia. Which is probably a lot stronger than real Russia. Nothing else to say. That was a cool new episode to a cool new show. I can't believe that Maria Hill is dead. We'll probably come to terms with that a few episodes down the line. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed that reaction. What was your favorite part of this episode? Over here is the next reaction. Whenever that comes out, over here is a playlist of my videos. And on my face is the subscribe button. Like, comment, subscribe, criticize even. I don't mind. See ya.